Hello, and welcome back to the stream. I hope everybody had a wonderful day. We are doing a challenge today, but first I just want to check on the swamp. So while I'm not really playing with the Shrek family today, when I was in my game, you know, because I come on here, I make people, I, I add in new venues, whatever. I noticed some things. There was a death. There was a death, y'all, that we missed. I missed, you missed, we missed. Me wumbo, you wumbo, you know, whatever. Guess who died? Guess. Guess who died? Let me see if a single person... Was it Farkley? Fuck no. What? I would sound a lot more excited if it... Doris, Reba, y'all are crazy! Belle, is it Farkley, Shrek, son? No one has guessed it right! <sighs> Thelonious. Pick number three, my lord. He's fucking dead. And he had just married Bella Goth, and they had just had a baby, and now he's dead. I don't know how he died. I don't know what happened to him, but he's fucking dead. Next order of business. I notice that um, Mrs. Bajorgman, uh, I don't know, what was what's her first name? The one that, she, Clara. Clara has had a newborn baby, and I remember her and Farkley fucked, right? So I went in there and I was like, whose baby is this, right? So if you come over here to Clara, Clara has now had a new baby since Bajorn died, okay? How did Clara come back to life? I don't know, and it really pisses me off. So she has had a son named Alexi, which I love that name for a boy, holy moly. And I was like, who the fuck is baby is this? Barnacle boy. So Barnacle Boy, and apparently he got a job as a bean blender. I don't know. I don't know. So I'm at work. Just popped in for a minute. Have a good night, all. We'll catch up on YouTube. Oh, Eric, I hope you have a great night at work. So Bean Blender Barnacle Boy had um, Alexi with Clara. So Clara, you know what? I'm not even going to feel bad about Farquifa. Not Farquifa. Why was I calling Farquad Farquifa? I am so sorry. I am so, 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 so sorry. Shrek. Shrek, it is too early for this. It is too- Look at him looking at me like that! Shrek, he said, side eye! Hold on, I gotta take a screenshot. This might be my new screensaver, to be honest. Hold on. Wait, where'd it go? Thank you. Yeah, new screensaver for my computer. What's going on with Shrek? That's another question I have. He's tense. He's feeling insecure. Okay, well... That's new. And then also, lost connections. Shrek has an intense desire for more social connections in life. On the plus side, all positive social interactions will take an extra boost during this crisis. Crisis? Oh, he's having a midlife crisis. Wow. Wow. Not Shrek having a midlife crisis. And what's even worse, I don't even have time for him today. I don't even have time for him today. Fiona left him. Listen, Victoria, Fiona been left him. Fiona left him at the beginning of the season. Fiona cheated on him with Farkley, of all people. Like, Fiona been, been left him. Been He's done had three other wives and another baby mama since then. Um, doesn't Shrek just show up in every social situation? I think we can all agree he's had plenty of interactions. Um, yeah, so apparently he's going through a midlife crisis, and then the last episode, if you weren't here last night, we found out that apparently, and y'all, y'all are just as surprised as me, apparently Granny Wolf thinks that Lord Farquaad is attractive, and he also thinks she's attractive, thank you Shan, thank you Dumpster Daddy Smith, and they made out, they made out, they didn't fuck. Not in her wolf form, anyways. And, um, but they did make out. So, how many kids does Shrek have? What a great little question. He has, well, he had the Shrek, well, first he had Farquifa because he fucked his ex wife's granddaughter, or his dead wife, because Fiona died, and then he fucked her granddaughter and had Farquifa. And then after that, he married. Um, the three princesses, and he had Shrekunzel, 
he had um, spark plug and snow shit. And then he had a love child, Jerrica, at a woohoo party with El Faba. And then after that, he had earwax with Rapunzel. So that was the only wife that he had two kids with. Um, I can't believe Farkley. <gasps> Y'all, more tea. More tea. Hold on. More tea to spill really quick. Fucking Farkley. Listen to me. Listen to me while I tell you this. If you haven't already seen the TikTok video. So this was on TikTok. So if you watch religiously on YouTube, you definitely need to listen to me right now. Farkley. Yes, Farkley. We found out on one of my unrelated TikTok videos earlier that he's married to the Red Queen. I had no idea. I don't know who authorized that because it wasn't me. And I should have known something like that was going to happen because Farkley's not in my active households. So also there's a dog outside losing its shit. So if that's annoying you, I'm sorry. It's annoying me too. Uh, what? Huh? They're all going rogue. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't the Red Queen have a baby with the Lorax? Yes. Oh, and, and another rogue moment that has happened. Oh my God, I almost forgot. I need to go into Managed Worlds anyway. Say goodbye to the swamp. Um, Someone else got married that I didn't authorize that also just had kids and was married to somebody else. Somebody, another one of my Sims did an unauthorized divorce and an unauthorized marriage into a family that I currently have a storyline going with. Mm -mm -mm. Guess who? Guess who? Guess, 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 guess. Fucking Maleficent? Is Maleficent Truffula now? Bitch, Lorax, I just gave you a whole two hour special. I just gave you a whole two hour special and you slide in on Maleficent? Uh uh. Uh uh. Who is approving these marriage licenses? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. He was married and he had a different baby mama. What in the fuck? Irking my nerve. Um, I thought Lorax was already married. Yeah, I, I thought so too. So you could believe me when I said, um, what the hell? Anyways, I'm gonna just let that slide for now. I can't believe he slid himself into the Shrekiverse like that. But anyways, today is not about them. In honor of me competing in this Winterland gaming competition, we're doing a Winterland themed episode, kind of. So we have Elsa, and you might be feeling a little turning in your stomach right now. What the fuck is about to, okay, he's kind of a jump scare. What is about to happen to Elsa, right? We have Voldemort, and the last time I made Voldemort, people complained he had a nose. So how you feel about that now? Thank you, Morgan, Angela, Britt, Isosceles Triangle, Nikki, Chantel, Lurk of the Shadows. Gee, Voldy, he's so real. He's beautiful. Yikes, I don't like it. Oh, stop smiling. Thank you. Anyway, I swear my Sims can hear me. Because tell me why I just told him to stop smiling and he immediately, immediately stopped. I don't like how much his. That's more. There we go. Also, if I could just get the head exactly how I want it. Oh my god, it's not doing what I want it to do. You know? I'm gonna just let it go. Anyways, as you may be concerned about, I'm gonna have Voldemort fuck Elsa. And we are about to breed out the Vold Elsa. So, and also if I don't see your gift that's sent, thank you. I'm not trying to ignore any of y'all. Um, we are at Elsa's castle. Now I wanted to put it up in like snowier mountains. However, that spot is being, fuck, I didn't put the, uh, I hate when I, you know, it's fine. Um, I wanted to put this up in the snowy mountains, but that spot's currently being taken by Santa's workshop and also the Grinch's mountain. So, so, we had to put Elsa's castle over here. Oh, oh no, they're off to a terrible start. It says, well, that was uncalled for. Lord Voldemort acting maliciously towards Elsa really left a sour taste in her mouth. It was Elsa wishing Sims could just be nice to each other instead of whatever that was. After reflecting on this rude interaction, could it be that Elsa dislikes malicious interactions? You know what? I'll tell you one thing. I do love an enemies to lovers trope. I don't know. Can y'all see how- Why did I just move her rock? Fuck. Anyways, can y'all see how far I am away from being back in the- Back in the leaderboards? Yesterday I was in it. I'm sure I'm out of it now. I'm actually like 100% sure I'm out of it now. But it should tell y'all- 
how far away I am from being in the ranked part, but I can't see it, to be honest. She needs to let it go, sorry. She's a little sad now. Why is he glowing? What did I do to where... Oh, it says deadened emotions. Um, while mere mortals experience a fiery inferno of emotions, vampires can simply say it is fine. Oh, I forgot, because he's a, technically a spellcaster and he has the vampire powers, so that, like, I gave him both, so that um, he can do whatever the fuck he wants, obviously. <laughs> Anyways, he's a celebrity. Uh, celebrity is giving him the sparkles. I don't actually like that, though, that it's giving him sparkles like that. Turn off the fame shine. I do like that people won't just talk to him, but I don't like that fucking sparkle. Why won't it turn off? Okay, I don't know how we're gonna get them to fuck because they hate each other already. Um, let's maybe try to flirt with it. Girl, how are you cold? Oh no, the paparazzi are here, fuck. No, 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 no. Ain't no way Elsa is about to freeze to death. No! Elsa, you are about to aggravate me. A lot I can tell throughout this challenge but it's okay for starters I don't want him to be famous I changed my mind and also okay there went the fame shine and then also let's get them to go inside the house so that they can have like, some privacy I don't know and you might be wonder oh, fuck I keep moving all of her little things you might be wondering where are their stuff because here's the here's the first floor we have this and then um we have this floor and then we have a bed and we have somewhere to put our baby that we're going to have there is no toilet there is no kitchen there is no shower but i have thought of a solution to this for starters over here in the woods there's a cauldron if you're hungry you can cook mac and cheese also keller kia said i don't see them happening oh they're happening oh they're happening that song that's like my god is an awesome god that's what my sims sing when they think about me it's happening anyways we also have two community bushes so if you need a fucking one if you need to shit in one do what you gotta do okay okay so other than the cleanliness aspect i don't know what they're gonna do about that i guess when they're at the bars they're gonna have to wash up so anyways that song is trauma <laughs> Thank you, Danielle, for subscribing. Um, can y'all go inside the house? Jesus Christ. Put the crystals back where they're supposed to go. Okay. This lady's really aggravating me, to be honest. And I'm not usually one to do this, but no, not that. Uh, what am I clicking wrong? Is it control? She's lucky I can't find it right this second. I was gonna delete her, but... Maybe I can just reset her. Okay, now she'll forget what she was doing. She real life is not willing to go inside with Voldemort right this second. Um, but we are going to. So please come upstairs. Please and thank you. What are you talking about? You can't get up there. Walk, 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 step, step, step. Walk, 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 step, step, step. Do I have a door? There is a door. So what the fuck? Why can't you get... Okay, well, we'll just teleport, I guess. Boom, teleport, boom teleport okay i need y'all to get along because we need to how will she take a pregnancy test at the hospital <laughs> at a bar i don't know describe the apocalypse oh he can talk about the wizard apocalypse happening in my other world i haven't checked on the wizard apocalypse in a while i hope they're okay um i'm gonna get him to flirt oh let's promise to dedicate her a song that's cute oh she's pissed Let's, uh, mock her. Don't mock. Don't, don't mock. Okay. Okay, she liked the song thing. She liked that. And then, um, let's- Oh, now she's flirty! Wow, told y'all. My god. Isn't awesome. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay. And then, compliment appearance. See, she's feeling it! Oh my god, he looks so scary. He look- Let's move that out of the way. He looks actually so scary. Oh, look at her staring at the snow. She loves it. And then come over here. Stuck in my head. <laughs> Does she find him attractive? Uh, let's be so fucking- Oh my god! That's actually terrifying. Um, thank you, Megan, for the LOL trophy. Thank you, Alyssa, for the 500 live fest. Oh my lord. Give them an outhouse. 
They have a bush. Um, let's do a pickup line on her. Oh, wait, somebody asked if... It says, congrats, you are now gaming ranking number 97. Well, that's a bonus because that's aside from the um, competition. That's just like the top 100 gamers. Damn, y'all were not lying when y'all told me a few weeks ago if I did one of these competitions, y'all would come through. She perceives them as basic looking and they have good compatibility, surprisingly. How does he see her? Watch him think that she's ugly. He also perceives her as basic looking. I feel like they're playing like mental chess right now. I feel like they're, cause they have good compatibility, but they're like, let's um, I don't want him to kiss her yet. It just seems so early. Uh, a man to be promiscuous? Huh? Oh, that's fucked up. It's so fucked up. You cannot command Queen Elsa to be promiscuous. You, you cannot. Command to undress? Ah! What in the book talk is going on? Oh my god, I had no idea. Okay, we're not gonna do that. That would be fucked up. Okay, um, we. I gotta save that for a different Let's Play. I got some ideas for that. Anyways, let's ask her if she's single. And then... Let, um, I'm over here taking my time. I have a bunch of time. And sadly, I actually do have to get off at 9 tonight. Um, I made a prompt. Oh, shit, are they kissing? Did I kiss? Uh, oh, my God. I did not even mean to click that that early. Fuck. Well, I did say we need to hurry up. And she let it happen. You know what? She's giving, she's giving Nesta. Except he's not giving Cassian. He is not giving Cassian at all. 41 for winter gamer land <gasps> oh shit that's how y'all know i will be going live every single day until um like i will not be taking a break from going live until this competition is over because i can't let it slip and if i take a break then i'll be out entirely so spoiler alert oh fuck well no that's not a spoiler alert actually <laughs> i'm just talking about characters because I haven't said anything that happens. No spoilers. You're 92 now. Thank you, Becca, Caitlin, Smith, Amanda, your current me, Ashley, Lucia. I kind of want to just go ahead and get them to fuck. Do you think we should do it in the family bush to break it in? Or do you think we should use the bed? I don't know. Number 85 now. That's... I don't think I've ever ranked in the top 100 ever. The bed... The bush, the bed, the bush, the bed. Okay, let's just do both because they're the first ones. So I feel like they should be the first ones to fuck in the bed and the bush. So let's do a bed fuck first and then a bush fuck. And then after that, we'll shower at the hospital when she's having the baby and then move on to the next one. Thank you, Unicorn Price, for the snow globe. I want to get a snow globe, like a real one. It just occurred to me when I was watching Christmas movies that I don't have a fucking snow globe. How lame is that? Honestly, I'm kind of ratchet this year. I don't even have a tree skirt, to be honest. But I want a snow globe. Bed ambush, good choice. Where are they going? Can they get up there? Oh, don't tell me I'm gonna have to teleport up there too. I don't know what's going on with them not being able to get up here. Or maybe they're just ignoring me. I don't know. Teleport and teleport. Mm, can we teleport right? Oh wait, I keep clicking things. Uh, why can she not teleport up here? It keeps saying like set up lot and whatever. You know what? We're just gonna have to go for the bush fuck. Jesus. Teleport here, and then you teleport over here too. Try for a baby with Elsa. Also, why is it getting hot outside? Absolutely not. This is Elsa's world that we are living in. So I think we should do, should we do blizzard or heavy snow? Blizzard. Girl, I haven't been able to watch these lives in weeks. Reunited with my people. I will say... This comment section honestly makes me want to figure out how to make a Discord so that- Because I feel like everyone vibes so well, and I feel like so many of us can make friends with each other that I really want to learn how to do a Discord so that you can just always chat in there, not only the hour that I'm live, you know? Oh, I love a snowy bush fuck. Family, swamp people, I would love that. I don't know how to use Discord, so I'm gonna have to get some- I have a couple friends that have told me that they will help me, but I haven't- I haven't figured it out yet. Should you get a P.O. box? Really? I have considered that as well. Uh, dude, she jumped in! 
Swanking for life. I don't even know what Discord is. Listen, I don't, I've never had a Discord because I don't understand it, but it's basically like where you can chat with, like chat rooms kind of. So it would uh, basically, uh, basically be like a big group chat that's just available at all times. Oh my God, not the choir practice outside again. It's super easy to use. Discord is easy. 90 message boards, chat rooms and gaming. Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure it out. Y'all know how slow I am with figuring things out though. Why is she, it says, what am I doing outside for me outside in a blizzard? Listen, Elsa, you're not very Elsa-ish. Oh, we have to take a pregnancy test. Um, damn it. I guess we are going to need a toilet. Let's do, actually, are there no like community toilets around? I'm not going to find one in a blizzard. Let's do a toilet. We'll do a literal community bathroom. <laughs> on the lot wait can we take a pregnancy test on one of these no we need a toilet for real goodbye community bathroom we will do this blue one for elsa someone catch me up we're getting voldemort and elsa to fuck well they just had an enemies to lovers moment and then um oh she's making some mac and cheese um but what was i saying oh we're breeding them out Dude, dude, this will be on YouTube, right? Yes. Thank you, Brain Dev, for subscribing to month three. She ran to come take this pregnancy test for real. Someone said there's a cold acclimation trait. Oh, she needs that. She need. Oh my God, she's pregnant. I was over here looking at the comments. I didn't even see that she was pregnant. <gasps> okay, y'all know that I'm just gonna go ahead and speed this pregnancy up. If you don't want to see um the gender, close your eyes right now. Close your eyes right now if you don't want to see the gender. I'm also going to try not to look. Here we go. Pregnancy phase in labor. Excellent. We're in labor. Let's go. Okay, let's just schedule a C-section because I don't even want Voldemort's magic running through her coochie, to be honest. So let's call and schedule a C-section. Talked up Elsa. Voldemort. Girl, where are we going? We're going to do a C-section. We're going to choose this option and then let's go ahead and go to the hospital. Boop, have baby at the hospital. Join and Voldemort come with Pookie. Oh my God, it's stuck in my head. It's stuck in my head. Popsicle Mort. <laughs> Thank you, Megan. Thank you, Lucia. Oh my God, I thought it might be little snowflakes on there for a second. Damn it. Oh, Voldemort's freaking out. Now, this um... This is not Voldemort's first baby, so we do have other Voldy babies. Aw, oh, damn it, I forgot. It's not Grinch day anymore. I'm so sorry, Elsa. You're actually going to have to have a baby in the Grinch room because your sim isn't fully dilated yet. But we chose- oh, we have to get our epidural. She went straight to that ball, too. Frosty Mort, <laughs> number 76 on gaming ranking. That's literally insane. Um... Thank you, Carly, for the three snowmen. Let's, uh, oh wait, he's not gonna dilate it. Doris, are you sick? Doris, honey, tell me. Why is Doris the patient here? Doris, are you okay? Are you okay? Doris is getting thin. She does look a little slender because usually she looks like a big booty bottomed ant. I'm gonna have to check on Doris later. Anyways, Mohawk Doctor, we need you to dilate this thing up or epidural it up, whatever. Can y'all stop crying over Brett Faba's wife with her little PlayStation 5 urn? She is pregnant? I don't, she better not be pregnant. Let me check. No, she's not pregnant. I'm more worried about her being sick because I technically do have a mod where they can technically catch fatal illnesses, but none of my important Sims have yet, so. Dude. She probably assumed this is one of Farkley's babies. <laughs> Maybe she's here for a pap smear. Thank you, Nicole, Rachel, and Shan. She's getting her tubes tied. <laughs> one would hope. Now we have to wait for this epidural to kick in. Um, I think, oh, it says pain relief. So I think we should be able to have the baby now. No, still not fully dilated. What the hell? It said she had some pain relief, though. Now that you mentioned it, one of them will probably get sick. I would be upset um okay maybe we should get some pitocin i don't know it's taking her a long time so let's start some pitocin with mohawk doctor 
Oh no, we can give birth now. Mohawk doctor, we need you. Frosty ween? <laughs> Hashtag pray for Doris. They just got her waiting out here too. Chili Mort, Blizzard Wizard. Oh, I like that. Frosty Titty, I already had a Frosted Titty. He actually just got hit by a car last week. Voloff, that's cute as fuck, actually. Voloff, I really like, I think that's my favorite one. I fell asleep when I got my epidurals for both of my kids. I'd be panicking, absolutely panicking. Elsa, you got, oh my God, now my game lagging for a second. Elsa looks like she is chilling. No pun intended. No pun intended. Baby name Panic. My first TikTok sub. Thank you for subscribing. Blizzy Wizzy. Oh, it's a boy. I was kind of hoping for a girl. I really like uh, Volov. Thank you, Nay, for the snowfall. I really like Volov. I think we should do Volov Mort. I'm honestly really excited to see what this baby is gonna look like and create a sim. Girl, let that pun attend. <laughs> She's also, what does it say? Contraction pain still? He just got her sewed up. He, it looks like he gave her a tummy tuck while he was in there because hot damn. If Reba has kids, they should be named Manic and Panic. Someone commented on the YouTube version of my lives and they said, they were like, just an idea. Maybe the reason that the magic was passed down to Reepa is because once the Reaper has children, they start to age. And so basically like the Grim Reaper would be aging with Doris right now because he fell in love and had kids and everything. So Reepa, if she has children, then she wouldn't be immortal anymore with Hades. And I was like, oh Lord, you're 29 in the winter thing. <gasps> I was not even in the top 50 when we started this live. I was like hoping to just get in like number 49 or something and just like barely make it into the competition. That is fucking crazy. Pixie supremacy. <laughs> Where is she running to? Um, I need to see this baby aged up. So I'm gonna put it outside in the snow really quick. Yay, congrats. You really need a discord. Um. I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna text someone after this live and ask them to help me set one up so that hopefully I can get that set up like ASAP. Where is she going? I don't, oh, she went to go sleep in the bush. Well, that's cute. Let's come age up the baby perhaps, bitch. Thank you. Also, let's get a Pixies at the castle at night. I think Maleficent's tower looks cooler personally, but... Let's see this baby. A redhead? A redheaded riddle? Say it ain't so. Um, that was not on my bingo bingo card for the evening. Um, let's bring Volof into create a sim. Imagine he looks perfect. Her sister is a redhead. <gasps> You're right. You're right. Who in the little Weasley fuck is this? You're telling me this isn't a Weasley right now? You're telling me this isn't a Weasley right now. So I can tell you one thing for sure. The Voldemort skin is not bred out. That is literally Voldemort's skin tone, for sure. He looks so terrifying. Check the poll, Pixie. I can't see the polls. How the fuck do I, hold on. I have to go on my phone to be able to see it. Uno momento. One second for me to go check the poll. Um, he has a nose. Who is the real father? Um, you yeah, have to like, oh my God, not my TikTok starting. Not somebody else's live coming up. Um, Pixarella. Let's see what the poll says. I don't see a poll, actually. I just went on for my other TikTok account and I literally don't see a poll. Um, we bred in more of the Hogwarts. Red hair, hit me down crib, must be a Weasley. 
Ron's been real quiet since this baby has been born. How do I vote on it? I don't even see a poll, to be honest. Oh wait, it's over here. I'm stupid. Gray or white skin? Oh, I think that's for sure some Voldemort, like, gray as shit. Like, it's like white, kind of, but it's like the Voldemort. Like, yeah. So, I guess I'm voting gray. <laughs> Not me voting in it, too. But let's, um, age him up. I'm kind of scared. I'm scared. Ready? One, two, three. He looks like a penis. <laughs> Voldemort. <laughs> um. <laughs> um. <laughs> he definitely looks like Elsa. Yeah. Um. I'm gonna be honest. I kind of want Voldemort and Elsa to have one more. I kind of want them to have one more kid real quick. I'm gonna just get her to shit it on the floor just so I can see another alternative really quick. Because I don't even know if I want to go on with this man. He's look at, He's giving me the creeps. He's giving me the Humpty Dumpty creep, like literally creeping me out. Farkley took his hair for, to the fair for the orange wool. <laughs> Can we get a toupee on this man? <laughs> oh my goodness. Elsa, I'm so sorry to do this to you right now, but I need you to have another baby for me. You're actually about to have two more babies for me because I need options. Pregnancy start. Oh no, you're not having it with Mohawk Doctor. Absolutely not. Um, Voldemort, I require your services for just a moment. I need a quick bush fuck, really quick. And then we're gonna shit a baby on the ground. Taya said, what did I miss? Well, Voldemort fucked Elsa, and then they had this ween-looking man. It's like a mix of a thumb and a very pale peener. And uh, I'm just not sure I can continue with that. So we're going to have some other options, and then we're going to pick. <laughs> Should have named him Baldwin. Uh, we could do better than the peener. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna make her have twins, I think. So that, okay, let's see if she's pregnant. She's pregnant with a girl. I'm gonna add, oh wait, not the face yet. I'm gonna add a boy in there too. And then face and labor. And then... Um, I'm gonna make it to where she can just go ahead and have the baby. And then, uh, where'd that crib go? Okay, unassisted birth. Go ahead, Elsa. She's got, oh my god, don't show me your coochie. Thank you. What if they both come out bald? <laughs> that would be, uh, a shame. <laughs> Name one Boldussy. We've already had a Boldussy. I've had a whole breed up of Voldemort challenge before, just not with Elsa. We have a Voldussy, we have a Voldy, we have a Voltinietta, we have a Voltanessa. Um, Peener and Selena. <laughs> uh, it's too good. Not Volva. Voltitty. I think we have a Voltitty. Okay, versus the boy. Let's do... I'm looking at y'all's suggestions. Do, 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 do. Voltage. Glizzy. Not Elmo. Um, we do have a Voltity. Yeah, I thought we had a Voltity more. Um, Volvo. We have a Volvo. He's had a lot of kids already, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. We have not had a Volvo. We have not had a Volvo. Let's do, I'm gonna just do Riddle Peen. 
and Snowy Vagine. Oh, she's tripping. She's tripping. Do, 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 do. Coldemort? Oh my god, I wish I would have seen that. That's too good. That's too good. Well, there went the one. Where's the other one? Thank you, Lucio, for the snow glove. Thank you, Dumpster Daddy, for the gingerbread man. Um, I'm at gaming ranking number 68. That's fucking crazy. Kiss Riddle Peen's forehead. <laughs> Thank you, Unicorn Farts, for the good night. Um, so Snowy Vagine and Riddle Peen. It says Elsa loves him with her whole heart. Her icy little heart. I need to find the other one really quick and put its bassinet out here. Do, do, do. There it is. So we're gonna put the other one right there. The snow stopped. Oh my goodness. Where is my blizzard? We'll just do heavy rain. And then I'm gonna get her to come over here and age up this one. And I'll get Voldemort to come age up this one. Thank you, Jess. Thank you, SJ. Thank you. Um, your current muse for the gifts. What number am I at in the gaming competition? The Winter Wonderland, whatever the fuck they're calling it. Do, do, do. This one has red hair, too. What about you, Riddle Peen? Riddle Peen has blonde hair. Snowy Vagine has red hair. Interesting. Interesting. Did I click heavy rain? I meant um heavy snow. Oopsies. Let's bring them into create a sim. It's the ginger uprising. Less lightning. Girl's a spellcaster. Is she? Snowy Vagine. Oh, Snowy Vagine got magic. And then Riddle Peen is a vampire. Interesting. I already like I already like these twins more than I like um Voldoween. But let's go and see what they look like all aged up. Let's do Riddle Peen first. One, two, three. You know what's embarrassing is when you fold for this man. That's what's embarrassing. That is what is embarrassing. Anyways, and then moving on. Moving on from him. Not the hook nose. <laughs> Why is he tropical? <laughs> Better than his brother. That's rock bottom. <laughs> That's Malachi McCullough. <laughs> Oh my goodness. He calls you mother as a pet name? Huh? Is that a thing? It's a no for me. <laughs> Let's see Snowy Vagine. Let's see Snowy Vagine aged up. Oh my Continue with Snowy Vagine. She looks the most like Voldemort and Elsa put together. Like, she's got Elsa's big eyes. She's got Voldemort's big bald forehead. Uh, <laughs> she mauled by her Tiger King brother. I'm crying. <laughs> oh, my goodness. This whole scenario is cursed. I guess we're gonna 
continue with her. Ooh, little jean skirt. I'm gonna give her kind of like an Elsa-ish dress, I think. Does this come in blue? Ooh. And then, um, I also have this. Is this more Elsa-like or is this more Elsa-like? Is this more Elsa? None of them are redeemable. <laughs> Listen, I think Snowy Vajeen slays, and I think she's about to have a great time. She'd slay more with hair. I don't want to cheat, though. We got to leave her in her natural way. The first dress with the sparkles. Okay, let's give her a little bracelet or something. Not that one, but we're going to give her one. Okay, let's give her some little shoes. Yes. Um, let's do some makeup on the bitch. That's very Elsa-like. Why does it look like she's trying to shit right now? Thank you, Chrissy, for the snowman. Thank you, Kurt Muse, Angela, Andy, Libby, App, Candy, Chantel. Um, mm, Oh, take that blood off. Good lord. Let's do a little blush. That's a lot of blush. A little blush. Put the hat back on. I'm getting there. Um, the cold never bothered me anyway. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Oh, no. Absolutely. I don't know how, but that's offensive. It just is. Um, she's giving Medusa. Lord, Lord, the lipstick is somehow terrifying. Um, Merry Christmas. Not the Granny Wolf, fucking. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's just occurred to me that I never use hats. Let's just do like a little hood on her. And then we could do like the little um cape thing too with it. Or we could just put a crown on her head. <laughs> she is a princess. She is a princess. Let her be an alopecia queen. Right. Yeah, I feel like we should just leave her in the crown. I'm gonna give her some earrings because she is a princess. Um, and I'm gonna be honest, I think bald kind of slays. Like, I don't think I could pull it off personally, but I do think bald slays on the right people. Now, is she the right people? Maybe not, but let's do a necklace too. Do, 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 Get the jewels out. Yes. Yes. She looks expensive. She looks expensive. Give her lashes. I agree. I should have been put lashes on her. What the fuck am I doing? Um, I'm gonna be honest. Her... I don't know, her eyelids, I guess you would call this, are not that great for eyelashes, but I guess. A cloak, I'll try the cloak on her. Did I just take off? No, I didn't, okay. Where is my, aw, uh, rest in peace Thelonious. Rest in peace to Thelonious. Um, put her crown back on. Can I have the cloak and the, um, I don't know where the fuck the cloak is, to be honest. There it is. If we do the cloak, we need a different dress. This looks weird. That's lingerie. Does this dress look better with the cloak? Ink her up. da 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 she could wear no no go back she could wear um 
Do it. Are any of these blue? No. This is Reepa's dress. I really don't want to have her in Reepa's dress. That is cute, but that is Reepa's dress. Reepa would be so... I feel like that's just like disrespecting Reepa, to be honest, to have her in her dress. Um, The dress she had on was so pretty. Are we talking about this one? Is it not weird that that comes into her boob crack? Is that not bizarre? I mean, if y'all are down, I'm down, but shit. Ooh, this kind of slays. I feel like this slays. This looks more like wintry, wintry uh, queen. Ooh, and she's showing off her magic. Interesting. Perfect, the drama. Okay, I agree. Let's do... Now, I don't know if we're going to be able to really see any tattoos at this point. Where the fuck are the tattoos? Body tattoos. Um, we might not be able to see them with clothes on, but when she takes them off. Let's do maybe like a flower on her ankle. Maybe not that one. Um, what is this? Oh, I can't even see it because of clock. I'm going to do these butterfly ones there. And then what is this? Oh, that's like tanning on her. That's cute. I wish I had more leg tattoos because... And just, I need to download more custom content tattoos in general. Um, hold on, let me see. So that, so you can kind of see this one coming out on her hand and then you'll see that one coming out right there. Do, 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 do. I don't think I have any head tattoos, but I am happy with how she looks. She looks perfectly creepy, and this is honestly what I'd kind of imagine the princess of Voldemort and Anna, or not Anna, uh, Elsa to look like. I do need to go ahead and end this live here because I promised somebody I would be off at nine tonight. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. This will be on YouTube later. Also, thank you everyone who participated in sending gifts, subscribing, and just liking the live and being here and watching and helping me compete in this Winterland competition. Um, we won't know till the end of the week if I place in it or not, but this is the first competition that I'm doing. And I really appreciate y'all showing me support and being here for me and not letting me get just embarrassed and demolished in this competition. So I do hope it brings more people to the live and checking out what we have going on over here. But we'll see how the rest of the week goes. But yes, thank you guys so much. I'll let y'all know about the Discord if I get that set up or not. And yeah, I hope y'all have a wonderful day tomorrow and rest of your night. Check on Doris. I think Doris is okay. I think she was just, just popping in there. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much. I hope y'all have a great night tonight and a great day tomorrow. And I'll see y'all again tomorrow night at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I love y'all. Good night.